Yo, y'all did not even see. We had to switch this. I, I'm gonna get you. Let me get you a brush. Cause you might like it on a brush, but just some more paint. Whoa. Okay, y'all. Hold on. Let me tell them real quick. Tell them what happened when we were, when we were outside. I saw the dog, and it was like big and and. So legacy big. is like, uh, she's doing like this squirming noise. It's like, uh, mm -hmm. uh, and I'm like, what is wrong? And she was like a dog. I look and it's a big pit bull literally right at the corner of the house. Right when we started the camera, I left the camera on, but I ran out of memory. So, um, either way, it wasn't going to be in the frame. Yeah. The did scene. you guys turn but your face? You guys, first of all, I, my heart is still beating because you know when you see a dog like a, especially a big dog you yeah, don't you don't want to move fast uh, you want to uh, make sure medium that you, big dog you have to string yeah you have to make sure that you move slow so legacy did good because she didn't like panic or anything we just i was just looking at the dog and we slowly came in the house and then we had the window open and then i had to go outside after the dog like went away, I went outside and got all the things. Yeah, and the paint. dog was digging himself <laughs> away to pee. And I called animal control, and they said that they've already received the call about this dog, so they need to come get it. And but most of the time, I mean, we live in a pretty like family type of neighborhood so i'm sure the dog I, is not aggressive or anything but you never oh, know I, you know like it's always just like um okay let me dip it in the water good job legend good job baby okay dip that one too okay yeah that one is dirty too okay here you go oh he wants to use the paintbrush oh okay paint your pumpkin good job whoa I like it, like it's your favorite. So yeah, your... yeah. Go wow, you painting your pumpkin? Oh, that's a good painting. I like it. it. it wow. But um, I'm going to have to switch my memory card out again. But yeah, guys, like when I tell you, this is a nice orange. Oh, Y'all, when I tell you, my heart was pounding uh, oh like, my goodness you mean like beating so much it was beating so hard mommy was so nervous but i had to be like strong for them and i i i i i was thinking that i i should talk to the dog like this no i'm glad you didn't try to like talk this. to the dog like this Upset uh, at you. Uh, Good yeah. job. You need more paint. Oh, you got some on your face? Don't touch your face. Here. Because he has so much itches. Because he, he needs the itch. Dog got an itch with a dog.
to do this like I don't know how many times but I have to do this very no 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 I have to do this very often because I don't know our trash can the kids will push the trash can they'll move the trash can and it creates this mark on the wall so I always get use the Mr. Clean Magic erasers the trash so I don't even think I was recording it so that looks a lot better once it dries obviously and then it's just like this area this whole area like the baseboards get really dirty over here you know because they kids do throw stuff in the trash by themselves but you know they be they be all over the place with it. So this whole area just be needing a, a wipe down often. Yeah, once that dries, it's gonna look so much better. to do like a deep clean in the kitchen is because I got that sign it's focusing on me I got the sign to go basically up there let me show you guys quickly what I got above here so far so I have this gather sign right down here I have a little coffee sign I have this clock right here um then I'm back here you guys probably have seen all of this because I've filmed in my kitchen before but um so I have this lantern up there they're like a bronze kind of color vases with nothing in them I like how they look like that right here this is temporary I just put this pumpkin and like this silver thing I used to have this on the table but with legend I can't have anything glass on the table I just thought that it goes very well with this up here okay First, I need to dust up there. Okay, that's nice and dusted. This is the sign. Happiness is homemade. I don't really like this font, but I just like the homemade because I felt like it was the most kitchen-y type of thing. Cause they didn't have like nothing that just said like kitchen. Just really want something to catch the eye upward since I have so much decor, like, you know, in the lower part. The reason why I have so much decor back there is just because we don't have a backsplash. Um, if we would have had a backsplash, I would have never like decorated that the kitchen this way you know like with signs back there but it's just because we don't have a backsplash and it was just so plain with the wall color that blends in like what kind of new build um house doesn't have a backsplash like what were they thinking so i got some command strips because i really don't want to poke any holes in the wall i'm gonna remove the hardware that it comes with so that it could be a flat service for the command strips and then I'll be right back.
know it's gonna feel like this. Yesterday when I was inside of at home, I knew that I was gonna get a sign, but I still felt mommy, like I should do like a, a layer of vases. Wait, mommy, mommy, look at this, come on. Um, like three vases or something. Um, and I feel, I still feel that way. I think it would look nice if there's like three vases. Guys, I have made lunch real quick. Um, I didn't film it because I was just trying to get it done. Because it honestly, it's late for us to be eating lunch. That means we'll probably have like a light dinner. Because they're eating burger. I just made them a burger patty. A burger patty. French fries. I made an air fryer and some corn. I microwaved it in the bag and then I put it in here so I could put butter and season it. Sorry that the, the TV is so loud. All right, guys, come on. The kids are eating. I'm gonna, I'm prepping some tilapia. I just seasoned it with black pepper, Old Bay, garlic powder, ground red pepper, and black pepper. And then I put some panko crumbs on top because I like for it to be a little crunchy. And I'm gonna go sit this in the air fryer. I'm gonna just be very careful. I pressed the panko crumbs in, but you know, some of them are probably gonna try to come out. So I'm just gonna sit it in the air fryer. And I never really know what, how much time I put on this. For fish, it says 374 for nine minutes, but I'm gonna do like eight and I'm gonna check on it. Every person wants to go up. She does. All right, y'all. So, my plates, my food is done. I'm eating rice, corn, and tilapia. I'm about to devour this. After a couple bites, that's when you know you know you're about to kill it or you're about to eat it. I'm about to kill it. And then I'll catch up with you guys later. I'm gonna probably end the vlog once we get dressed and ready to go because I know this vlog is probably long from painting, cleaning. Been doing everything today, baby. I'm gonna be tired, but it's okay. Um, I'm gonna see you guys in a minute. All right, y'all, we're about to go um, drop off some cupcakes to um, their grandma and their auntie. So, yeah, we're dressed. I don't have a dress on. I said you're dressed. You got dressed for some outside. And I have on just some jeans. But, yeah, I'm going to end this vlog here. Thanks so much for hanging out with us today. Um, if you're new to the channel, I hope that you consider subscribing. And if you're not new, um, thanks for watching again, y'all. And make sure you give this video a thumbs up. And we'll see you guys in our next video. Peace. Say bye. Bye, Daddy. Bye, guys. Bye, guys.